Your electric park brake, or EPB, is designed to prevent rolling while parked. So before leaving the vehicle, make sure the park brake is applied. Also, make sure the transmission is in park. You'll find the EPB switch on your instrument panel. To apply the park brake manually, push the switch momentarily. You'll hear a whirring noise while it engages. Once engaged, you'll see a light on the switch and a brake warning in your instrument cluster. If auto park brake is enabled, the EPB will engage whenever you shift into park. The park brake will release any time the ignition is cycled into the run position, the transmission is in drive or reverse, and the seat belt is buckled. To release the park brake manually, the ignition must be in the run position. Depress the brake pedal, then push the park brake switch momentarily. Once the park brake is disengaged, the brake warning lamp and switch light will both go out. If rare and exceptional circumstances make it necessary to engage the park brake while in motion, push the switch for as long as engagement is desired. The brake warning lamp will appear and you'll hear a warning chime. The rear stop lamps will illuminate automatically while the vehicle is in motion. To disengage the park brake while in motion, release the switch. If you come to a complete stop using the EPB, once you reach approximately 3 miles per hour or 4.8 kilometers per hour, the park brake will remain engaged. Your vehicle's electric park brake also features Safe Hold. Safe Hold is a safety feature that will engage the park brake automatically if the vehicle is left unsecured while the ignition switch is in the run position when the engine is on. For example, Safe Hold will automatically engage the park brake if the vehicle is at a standstill. There is no attempt to depress the brake pedal or accelerator pedal, the seat belt is unbuckled, and the driver's door is open. This video is not intended to take the place of your owner's manual. For complete details and other important safety information, please see your owner's information.